Yo, yo, it's Trey from Boas Abound. Um, I decided to start making videos about boas um, today, actually. <laughs> uh, mainly because I'm searching through YouTube, I'm searching through the internet, and it's just not a lot of boa constrictor content. And I feel like um, I can contribute to that. And if you're like me and you love boa constrictors, you're probably searching for, uh, you know, good content as well. So with that said, um, if you know me posting videos gets good reception if people are liking and subscribing and that good stuff then I'll post my collection and certain topics on a rather consistent basis if you guys feeling it then I get the people what they want <laughs> with that said uh, I'm going to make my very first video about the IMG gene it is a rather you know, popular gene in the bow constricted community increased melanin gene or increasing melanism gene increasing melanistic gene whatever you want to say IMG uh, I'm not gonna take videos or record all of my IMG collection. I do a few, um, but some are actually actively courting and uh, breeding right now, so I don't wanna interrupt them while they're doing that. Um, and it's really early in the morning. It's like 2.30 in the morning. So um, without further ado, we're gonna get right into it, and um, I hope you guys like it. Like I said, if you subscribe and you, you like and you notify and all of that good stuff, um, then I'll continue to to keep making videos about boa constrictors because it's just not enough. It's just not enough good boa constrictor videos on the internet. So, here we go. So, this is one of my favorite IMGs. It's an IMG Jungle Motley Het VPI T positive male. Really, really pretty snake. Actually, just did waters recently, so I just had him out. So I'm not gonna take him out again, but you can see that really nice iridescence as all IMGs have, or the darker ones at least. Thinking about pairing him up this year. He's a little young, but he has the size. So we'll see. Next up is a IMG Hypo Jungle female. Pretty little girl. I actually have her um, up for sale. Might keep her though. I just, I have a lot of duplicates of uh, IMG stuff. So kind of thinning out the herd. Um, but if she stays, I won't be disappointed. You know how that goes. Here is my IMG double head striped tail and call albino paired up with this really pretty um, coral sun glow. He's taking a rest right now, not in action. I don't want to bother them too much. He might get back to it here in a bit, but since I'm doing an IMG video, figured I'd show him too. is my big beautiful IMG Sun Glow female probably ready for a tub upgrade here soon this is a CB70 rack system I think she's about four feet something like that but um yeah you notice how an IMG um, Sun Glow you get a lot of white uh, around the saddles of the tail um, typically you don't see that in sun glows but with IMG sun glows you get this uh, peachy coloration as well as the presence of those white rings so this is my IMG ghost it has a really really nice tail stripe more than halfway down his body um, he bred for me this year he was paired with a uh, Aztec head annery so 
hopefully he got the job done. It's a lot of really cool combinations that can come from that pairing. Um, super nice disposition. He actually has two different colored eyes, which I think is cool. That's a darker eye. I'll swing over here. See that eye is lighter. So this eye is like a bluish gray and the other eye is like a regular color. So I thought that was really cool when I picked him up. So hopefully got the job done for me this season. We'll see here soon. Well, in four months. <laughs> This is my absolutely gorgeous IMG Arabesque Het Call Albino female. She is in shit right now, deep shit. Love how uh, she's dark, but she retained the pattern. I think that's really cool. Uh, I'm gonna try to do as much as that in my program as possible. I really like the darkness of IMGs, obviously. Um, and it, you know, kind of gets boring when you have just a whole bunch of completely black snakes. You gotta have at least one in the collection, but when you can keep the pattern, um, it's a game changer. So I really love how this girl is turning out. This is my IMG uh, Hypo Jungle male. Um, it's breeding for me this year. I'm giving him a couple days off right now because he's in shed. Um, as soon as he sheds, I'm going to toss him back in with the female. But he's been doing a great job. Pretty aggressive breeder. And this is his first year being paired up. 2018. Um, or early 2018, I should say. And he's doing awesome. So this is <clears throat> my IMG Hypo Head Call Albino Female. Um, some really good size on this girl. Eats great, really chill, temperament, beautiful. I like how she's getting um, darker pretty quick, um, even with the hypo gene. So there's a lot of like golds in her also that I really like. Um, currently she is available for sale, but just like anything I sell, if she stays, I won't be disappointed at all. But really good looking snake and uh, if I keep her, I got a lot of different things I can pair it with to get some cool combinations. So this is my IMG Jungle Motley Possible Head Call Snow. And uh, it's probably the darkest IMG I have. His, his iridescence is just crazy. Every time I look at him, he just looks like he's like wet. Super dope the way the light bounces off of this guy. And he is paired with a lipstick sun glow. So uh, a lot of different combinations possible with this pair here. Really excited about the uh, possibility of what's to come. Now this guy is probably my favorite not probably he is my favorite IMG in my collection he is an IMG hypo jungle motley head VPI possible head blood absolutely magnificent um, I had him paired with a pink panther VPI female earlier and uh, she ovulated so hopefully he got the job done they're both um, first timers so We'll see here soon. Super excited. One of my probably top five pairs this season. I just love this guy. It's awesome. So that was my very first YouTube video um, about boa constrictors. Hopefully you guys liked it. Um, I got some really cool stuff and I just want to share, um, you know, my collection with you guys and a little bit of knowledge I do have about boa constrictors. I don't know everything, but I do know a little bit. Um, so with that said, please subscribe, hit that notification, hit the like, all of the stuff the YouTubers say. Like I said, I'm a novice at this, um, but I do need to come up with some type of catchy phrase or, or line at the end of these videos. Hopefully you guys can help me out with that too. But uh, I appreciate you and until next time, peace.